So pre-launching your product is a great strategy to get a lot more sales for your seven-figure product launch. This applies in e-commerce, drop shipping, SaaS, info products, memberships, all kinds of products. Like if you look at the top selling uh, products from the best brands, you know, in the consumer market, whether you look at like the Apple iPhone or the latest uh, Samsung or, you know, the latest and hottest uh, video game titles, basically what you see in a lot of cases is you see them building up bars in anticipation sometimes months in advance of the actual product beca ever becoming available in stores. Uh, and so that's, that's because it's a really powerful strategy that will help you absolutely get a lot more sales. So the entire philosophy behind pre-launching is to build awareness in the market so that the market starts anticipating your product. If you wait until launch day to actually announce your product, and start talking about your product, no one is gonna be listening, okay? So this is why you absolutely want to use a, a pre-launch strategy. Um, it's gonna absolutely increase sales of your products. It's gonna help you sell out. Like if you have a limited number of slots, let's say it's kind of some kind of group course uh, where you only have 200 slots. Uh, this is actually how you get it uh, sold out quickly after launching is First, do a pre-launch, start talking about it, um, start building awareness, start letting people know what day or what date the product is launching so that they are looking forward to buy. And then when you announce the product is now ready to buy, uh, then people are actually going to get that chance to get in right away. Now, there's a second type of launch, right, which is like the stealth launch, where you don't announce nothing. Instead, uh, you just kind of go out in the market very quietly. You make the product available. Now, this might help, like, if, you know, in certain cases, if you don't want your competitors to know, like, you're coming out maybe with this really cool, unique product, you, you kind of want to create some space where people are not knocking you off. Maybe it's a new type of sneaker, some new design of clothes that, you know, a lot of people are going to, like, you found this product, but, you know, a lot of people are going to, be able to come out with something very similar. So you can do like a stealth launch instead of announcing months in advance, right? This, this way you, you, you get the chance to not alert the competition. Uh, but what happens with that type of launch is now you have to do all the heavy work of building awareness when you launch. Uh, and you can, you know, you can announce it to your social media, you can announce it to your email subscribers, people visiting your online store, if you're an e-commerce shop or in-app, if you are a SaaS uh, or some other type of app, you can, you know, let them know like, oh, we have this new AI generator type upgrade that we're making available and you can make that announcement in-app. But you have to do a lot more heavy lifting because you didn't prepare the market in advance. So you better make sure they want this thing, they love this thing, and that would be the right kind of circumstances where you wanna do a stealth launch. But for most beginners out there, I would recommend going the pre-launch route because what it does is it makes time work in your advantage where you have more time where more people are gonna become aware of your product. And what that does is it ensures that on launch day, you're getting a higher response and more people are buying. Now, if you want some free resources to get more product sales, you can, you can book a free brainstorm call. You can also grab my free book as well as my free bootcamp. The links will be in the description.